270, 450 out. That's what he was going for That's last what he's time. Going for last time. And he's got to put it down on the jumps. I don't know if his rails are stronger than Mark McMorris's, to be to be totally honest with you. Frontside 10, backside triple. Oh, my goodness! Yuki Kadono now, what can he do? Is he going to do back to back? Back to back <gasps> triple court, 16 20s. Oh, and everyone's going Are absolutely you crazy. kidding me? Mark McMorris became the first rider in US Open history to do back-to-back -back triple corks, and then Yuki Kadono becomes the second rider, but he makes them 16-20s. Look at these guys putting Yuki Kadono on their shoulders. Stale Sonbeck gladly stepping out of the spotlight and saying, you know what, today might just be your day, young man. I've literally got goosebumps. And the best thing was, it, I just, look at it, it's just perfect. It's like he's done 10,000 of them. Gap lip slide. Now, we see this 270 out, which is what he meant to do earlier. Remember, we spoke about it catching him off guard. And I think this is the run he wanted to do second time around. He didn't get chance because he was ending up switch. Front side double cork 1080. So that is, okay, the front side double cork 1080 is the weakest of his three jumps. He still scored an 8.1 out of 10. Now, watch this. No one has ever done this in the history of competitive snowboarding. Backside triple cork 1620. I can't believe I'm saying that. And then, <laughs> oh my goodness. I feel like I've just kissed a girl for the first time. That is the best thing I've ever seen. 